Word of unfailing love. Psalms chapter 141 O Lord, I call upon you, hasten to me, give ear to my voice when I call to you. Verse 2 Let my prayer be counted as incense before you. and the lifting up of my hands as the evening sacrifice. 3. Set a guard, O Lord, over my mouth. Keep watch over the door of my lips. 4. Do not let my heart incline to any evil. To busy myself with wicked deeds in company with men who work iniquity and let me not eat of their delicacies. Five. Let a righteous man strike me it is a kindness let him rebuke me it is oil for my head let my head not refuse it yet my prayer is continually against their evil deeds 6 when their judges are thrown over the cliff then they shall hear my words, for they are pleasant. As when one ploughs and breaks up the earth, so shall our bones be scattered at the mouth of Shaol. 8. But my eyes are towards you, O God, my Lord. In you I seek refuge. Leave me not defenseless. 9. Keep me from the trap that they have laid for me and from the snares of evildoers. 10. Let the wicked fall into their own nets which I pass by safely. Psalms chapter 142 verse 1 With my voice I cry out to the Lord With my voice I plead for mercy to the Lord 2. I pour out my complaint before him I tell my trouble before him. 3. When my spirit faints within me, you know my way. In the path where I walk, they have hidden a trap for me. 4. Let to the 4. Look to the right and see. There is none who takes notice of me. No refuge reminds to me no one cares for my soul. 5. I cry to you, O Lord. I say, you are my refuge, my portion in the land of the living. 6. Attend to my cry, for I am brought very low. Deliver me from my persecutors, but they are too strong for me. Seven, bring me out of prison.
that I may give thanks to your name. The righteous will surround me, for you will lead bountifully with me. Psalms 143 verse 1 Hear my prayer, O Lord, give ear to my place for mercy. In your faithfulness answer me in your righteousness. 2. Enter not into judgment with your servant, for no one living is righteous before you. 3. For the enemy has pursued my soul, he has crushed my life to the ground. He has made me sit in darkness like those long dead. 4. Therefore, my spirit faints within me. My heart within me is appalled. 5. I remember the days of old. I meditate on all that you have done. I ponder the work of your hands. 6. I stretch out my hands to you. My soul thirsts for you like a parched land. 7. Answer me quickly, O Lord. My spirit fails. Hide not your face from me, lest I be like those who go down to the pit. 8. Let me hear in the morning of your steadfast love, for in you I trust. Make me now, make me know the way I should go. For to you I lift up my soul. 8. Let me hear in the morning of your steadfast love, for in you I trust. Make me know the way I should go. For to you I lift up my soul. 9. Deliver me from my enemies, O Lord. I have fled to you for refuge. 10. Teach me to do your will, for you are my God. Let your good spirit lead me on level ground. 11. For your name's sake, O Lord, preserve my life. In your righteousness, bring my soul out of trouble. 12. And in your steadfast love you will cut off my enemies. And you will destroy all the adversaries of my soul, for I am your servant. Psalms 144 Blessed be the Lord my rock, who trains my hands for war, and my fingers for battle. 2. He is my steadfast love and my fortress, my stronghold and my deliverer, my shield and he in whom I take refuge, who subdues peoples under me. 3. O Lord, what is man that you regard him, or the son of man that you think of him? 4. Man is like a breath, his days are like a passing shadow. 5. Bow your heavens, O Lord, and come down. Touch the mountains so that they smoke. 6. Flash forth the lightning and scatter them. Send out your arrows and rout them. 7. Stretch out your hand from on high. Rescue me and deliver me from the many waters, from the hand of foreigners. 8. Whose mouths speak lies, and whose right hand is a right hand of falsehood. 9. I will sing a new song to you, O God, upon a ten stringed harp I will play to you. 10. Who gives victory to kings? Who rescues David his servant from the cruel sword? 11. Rescue me and deliver me from the hand of foreigners whose mouths speak lies and whose right hand is a right hand of falsehood.
12. May our sons in their youth be like plants full grown, our daughters like corner pillars cut for the structure of a palace. Thirteen. May our granaries be full, providing all kinds of produce. May our sheep bring forth thousands and ten thousands in our fields. Fourteen. May our cattle be heavy with young, suffering no mishap or failure in bearing. May there be no cry of distress in our streets. 15. Blessed are the people to whom such blessings fall. Blessed are the people whose God is the Lord. Psalms 145 I will extol you, my God and King, and bless your name forever and ever. Verse 2 Every day I will bless you and praise your name forever and ever. 3 Great is the Lord and greatly to be praised, and his greatness is unsearchable. 4. One generation shall command your works to another and shall declare your mighty acts. 5. On the glorious splendor of your majesty and on your wondrous works I will meditate. 6. They shall speak of the might of your awesome deeds and I will declare your greatness. 7. They shall pour forth the fame of your abundant goodness and shall sing aloud of your righteousness. 8. The Lord is gracious and merciful, slow to anger and abounding in steadfast love. 9. The Lord is good to all and His mercy is over all that He has made. 10. All your works shall give thanks to you, O Lord, and all your saints shall bless you, and all your saints shall bless you. 11. They shall speak of the glory of your kingdom and tell of your power. 12. To make known to the children of man your mighty deeds and the glorious splendor of your kingdom. 13. Your kingdom is an everlasting kingdom and your dominion endures throughout all generations. The Lord is faithful in all his works and kind in all his works. 14. The Lord upholds all who are falling and rises up all who are bowed down. 15. The eyes of all look to you and you give them food in due season. 15. The eyes of all look to you and you give them their food in due season. 16. You open your hand you satisfy the desire of every living thing. 17. The Lord is righteous in all his ways and kind in all his works. 18. The Lord is near to all who call on him, to all who call on him in truth. 19. He fulfills the desire of those who fear him. He also hears their cry and saves them. 20. The Lord preserves all who love him, but all the wicked he will destroy. 21. My mouth will speak the praise of the Lord, and let all flesh bless his holy name forever and ever.